Portsmouth in what appears to be the start of justice for a family who lost a young life to gunfire in the days before Christmas. Last night, we told you about an arrest made in the shooting death of 12-year-old Keeman Battle. The suspect also underage tonight. Keeman's family talks about the arrest. Turn on your side's Kayla Gaskins has new information. Kayla? Well, Anita, the suspect that police arrested for this was 14 years old. According to the victim's family, the two of them were friends. It's been a painful past few weeks for all of those involved. An arrest for the deadly shooting of a loved one doesn't necessarily mean closure. It feels like justice. It doesn't feel like closure. He um, got manslaughter. He didn't get murder. If you ask Tyquisha Artis, her nephew's killer deserves more severe punishment because, in her opinion, manslaughter equals mistake. And she says she does not believe her nephew's death was a mistake. Charges should have been a little harsher. Keeman's cousin, school board member DeAndre Barnes, says news of the arrest was bittersweet because the suspect was also just a kid. I'm kind of hurt that it's just another kid. Yeah, and that seems to be the growing statements from everybody that another kid was involved. So now we have two kids who lost their life, pretty much. Barnes says he knows the young suspect through his involvement in community outreach programs. He was he was just another kid, just like all the other kids. He he, when we were out there doing programs, he would participate in the activities as far as the sports. Barnes says the community as a whole failed both young men, the victim and the suspect. When the problem happens, it didn't start today. It started a long time ago. So. It was also the community, however, that came forward with information and tips to help make sure Keeman's killer didn't walk free. But I just, you know, happy that people did come forward and feel, you know, sympathy for me and my family. Well, because the suspect is a juvenile, police have not released the name. Reporting live in Portsmouth, I'm Kayla Gaskins, 10 on your side.